biscuit. I got my barbecue shoes on. Welcome to BarbecuePitBoys.com. Today we're cooking up some chili pepper rib steak subs at the pit. And they're real easy to do. All right. To get started, we've got ourselves some rib steaks. And look at the marbling in there. Oh, man. Awesome. Guaranteed, moist, and tender. Pick up the best quality steak for these subs as you can get, right? All right, so we're going to be doing some one-pan cooking. And uh, so we're going to have to cut these steaks up real thin. Whoa, and I think you know all about how to do that, right? <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah, these are good enough to eat already. But we'll cook them because we don't want the food police come knocking, right? <laughs> All right, the rib steaks have been cut real thin. Now the veggies. We've got green onions, uh, sweet onions. And here's the magic. We've got the chili peppers, habanero. Uh, we've got cherry peppers, poblanos. we got some green, long green stem chili peppers. Oh, 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 they're real good. Of course, use the chili peppers you like and what you can source. Now, let's get started. We're going to add some of that veggie oil to this one pan, which most of you know it's a wok, right? Great for camping, outdoors, single pan. It gets it done. Now, into this particular dish, we're going to throw some garlic. We threw in some green onion. And we threw in that rib steak, nice and thin. Oh, just like that. Oh, man. Now you can serve each dish up the way you want, all right? Now we're gonna add some SPG. Of course, you gotta have some seasoning, some salt and pepper. Whoa, yeah. Now, we like our onions al dente in the sandwich, so we'll throw some veggie onions in there. <laughs> it smells good. Nothing like kicking back at the camp, right? cooking up some good food all right that sandwich is done and that was let out the chili peppers all right you serve it up the way you want now let's do some with the chili peppers throw in some uh, veggie oil throw in some of that uh, beef steak or rib steak and you want to cook real hot and that's the great thing about using these walks keep it real hot It'll come out unbelievable. Now, in go the chili peppers, some onions. <laughs> oh, baby. We're going to be eating good tonight, Martha. It's too bad you're not with us. All right. Keep the spatula moving. Keep that pan real hot. That's the magic of good cooking, right? The walk. Of course, a lot of you fans already know that. All right, simple enough. Mm. Oh yeah, that's just about done. Whew. Oh man, put it on a good roll or eat it off a straight plate, but we're doing subs, right? Pile it on good. Whoa, Look at that. All right. We've got nothing better to do. We're kicking back, so uh, let's make another sub. Garlic. Steak. Oh, yeah. Throw in some chili peppers. The more the better. And for those of you asking, it's not that hot. It's quite reasonable. Now, some more seasoning, of course. Keep it hot. Keep it moving. Oh, yeah. Let's throw some more onion in there. Those are those sweet Vidalia onions, sweet as apples. Just put them in there last. Keep them al dente, right? All right. Time to... Sub it up. Oh, man. Are you getting hungry or what? And if you're not, 
You're on the wrong damn channel, right? <laughs> All right. Thumbs up. And of course, as always, we do apologize for eating in front of you like this, but we call this Pitmaster Privilege. <laughs> You're just going to have to get your own beef and chili peppers, right? So the next time you're looking for a recipe for your pit, check out barbecuepitboys.com.